Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up multiple monitors using your laptop or your desktop computers. I have a laptop here and I do have two monitors here. So it's going to be a total of three monitors and I'm going to use a Dell docking station to do the connection. But if you have a desktop, basically in your desktop, you will have a video card that has multiple HDMI port or if you don't have enough HDMI port, you can use USB also. This is a USB connector 2 and uh, the display, this is an older display, but right now you can get a USB to HDMI display so you can connect to your monitor from the USB. The first step in the process is you need to cable up your monitors connect the monitor to the power and then connect the HDMI to here and do the same thing for this monitor and connect the HDMI here so you have both HDMI connected to your docking station I am connecting the docking station to the laptop using the USB-C connector now you can see both of my monitors are going to light up to set up your multiple displays right click on the desktop and go to display settings and then you can see these monitor numbers and these need to match how you have physically aligned your monitors just click on the identify and see what the numbers look like so one two and three is this one but if you look at here it exactly match how i have physically aligned my monitors but you can drag and drop and change the order so let's uh, identify again and you still will see the layout won't change in here so you need to arrange this one according to your physical layout so this is one this is two this is three and now it's time to set up your main monitor most of the time you want to make smallest one as your main one and uh, keep other bigger ones as your extra monitors to extend windows to there so i'm going to go back again to the display settings and i'm going to go down and you can see number one is the main display now you have all your shortcuts and everything will be on your main display so let me show you how to change it if you like to go down here and click on the monitor say if you want to make number three as your main monitor click on that one so it will be highlighted and go down and make this as the main display you will see all your desktop icons will move to that monitor i'm going to come back and select number one as my main display and then I'm going to select extend desktop to this display. So that means both of these monitors will act as an independent monitor. So you can drag things and drop it where you want it. For example, say if you open a web browser, move it to your third monitor and then open file explorer and move it to your second monitor and open something else say adobe and keep it in your main monitor you also can do another kind of settings say you can combine two monitors to display the same thing on both of them so in that case say you go to one of your monitors and then you go here and say duplicate desktop on one and two that means you will see same display on one and two keep changes you see you have same display on both of them if you open a browser you will see on both of them you will see here one and two are now combined one slash two and three is independent i'm going to go back and change that to extend desktop on one and two 
keep changes. So this is the previous settings you had. You move them independently. I'm going to go back and do the other way around. And I'm going to make one and three as single display. So go back here, duplicate desktop on one and three. That means you will see both of them are here. Now I'm going to go back and change it back to normal. That is extend one and three. And now I am back to my regular setup. When it come to flow of the mouse, I have no problem. You see, I'm moving from here to here. I have no problem. If you match your physical layout with this logical layout, you won't have any problem. So make this one as my main monitor, close this and I can move and I can move the mouse without any problem. I go here, change this as my main monitor, close it and uh, I can move my mouse and go here so i have no problem so you need to match your physical layout to your logical layout so your mouse flow won't have any problem in my case i have to keep this one in the middle because my table is kind of small but if you have a big table you can keep this laptop on the side as number one and you can put a usb keyboard here like i have a usb mouse connected to uh, this one you can plug in a usb keyboard also to this docking station and you can leave this small monitor on the side and you can work off these uh, three monitors maybe you keep the email on this one one two three and you can move the mouse across also if this video is informative to you Give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more of my videos, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification.